cracking YouTube, it's your boy Professor Crypto. Got another hot crypto class for you guys today. This one's on fire. You guys already know anything we bring on the channel, it's got that heat, got that potential, and it definitely should be watched. This one is no different, guys. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Class is now in session. This one is called PZM Cash. Now, guys, we've already done two videos on PZM Cash. This is our third video on the platform. They are a new cryptocurrency project, guys, and today I want to review their white paper with you their white paper is 35 pages long guys very very detailed and transparent to start off i'd like to just recap what pzm cash is give you that introduction again just to refresh your memory pzm cash is a cryptocurrency related as a means of payment for a fast growing digital ecosystem in which the economic motives of each individual participant provide an increase in the overall wealth and well-being of the entire community the main strategic success factor for pzm cash is the fact that it will be relying on the growth of scale and balancing of supply and demand for funds. The advantages of the PCM Cash architecture, sidechains providing security for the main ledger, proof of stake consensus algorithm, a large number of functions and development opportunities for developers of decentralized application. The PCM Cash guys has significantly upgraded the POS consensus algorithm that has been used earlier. The commission for transactions in the PCM Cash network is fixed, which guarantees the fair distribution of remuneration among the forgers. The key difference between PCM Cash and the classic POS OS concept lies in the mechanism of ensuring network with monetary supply. The PZM Cash team refrained from a full emission approach when generating the first block. Only 1% of the total number of coins will be distributed when the network is launched using pre-mining. The remaining coins will be issued during POS mining as incentive payments to loyal PZM Cash holders for the supporting network. POS mining mechanism has two main components as I mentioned guys. It has the leading activated wallet, the supporting wallets which are the wallets activated by a transaction from a leading wallet. Remuneration payments are made to the leading wallet. However, their size is determined by the balance of the leading wallet and the balance balances of all supporting wallets. Moreover, the number of coins on the balances is the only factor affecting payments. There will be no changes in the size of payments over time. The PZM Cash Wallet. The PZM Cash Wallet is a universal tool for managing coins on the balance of each unique user account. The wallet allows users to conduct outgoing transactions using the user's private key and generate details while the keys for receiving transactions from other users. The wallet functionality, carrying out P2P transactions, conducting transactions during the execution of smart contracts, creating smart contracts using templates, providing access to decentralized applications of the PZM Cash ecosystem, displaying the balance of the wallet and the dynamics of the transaction. Web3.js The implementation of PZM Cash in JavaScript enables the use of Web3.js technology, which significantly expanded the capabilities of the PZM Cash wallet thanks to unification. The wallet can be used on the platforms of our partners, for example, on exchanges and in casinos, without creating a separate wallet for each project. Moreover, the browser implementation eliminates the need for a blockchain core for integrating new channels. Smart contracts. Our wallet allows users to send transactions not only to the addresses of the other network participants, but also to the addresses of smart contracts by initiating various transactions based on a digital algorithm. Smart contracts are a digital protocol that uses mathematical algorithms to automatically complete the transaction after some established conditions are met. The process is completely controlled by the logic of the algorithm and therefore the participation of a third party is not required for the execution of the smart contract which acts as a guarantor of the invariability of the code. The invariability of the code itself is guaranteed by the writing of the code and the smart contract of the blockchain the moment the code is created. The protocol, the distributed ledger and the nodes. The blockchain is a database ledger implemented through the concept of an interconnected list in which each new record contains information about the previous one in encrypted hashed form. The ledger provides a permanent record of transactions that have taken place and also establishes the order in which the transactions were made. The main advantage to the blockchain is its resilience to any changes. If any block is changed, for example, as a result of an attack, then all subsequent blocks will automatically be changed, which leads to the instant detection of any attempts of forgery. The PZM Cash cryptocurrency is implemented on the blockchain and focused on the development, improvement, and expansion of the functionality of decentralized applications. The application of PZM Cash's approach allows for achieving unlimited scalability, increased network security, 
expansion of development capabilities, and the implementation of sidechains. Each PZM cache block contains the following information. Information about the block, the block version and unique block identifier, block timestamps expressed in seconds, identifier and cryptographic hash of the previous block, information received from the sidechains, network status metric, the nugget, ID of the account that created the block, as well as the public key of the given account needed to identify it. Transaction information, the number of transactions stored in the block, transaction data, data of all the transactions including the block, including their identifiers, the total amount of PZM cash on the transactions included in the block, including the amount of commissions, data on smart contracts, information on the status of the smart contracts, block payload length, and the hash value of the block payload, the value of the forging bar, and the cumulative complexity for the block. Something that's very interesting to me guys is the network scaling i think this will be very interesting to you as well which is why i'm going to go over it as already noted the main characteristics of pzm cash is its orientation to the rapid scalability of both the money supply and the offer of services from developers and partners the development of scaling of the pzm cash infrastructure can be carried out in several directions one creating d apps in this case any developer can deploy their decentralized application they will thus be allocated their own sidechain recorded on the top of the main ledger. In this case, each user of the application will have their own wallet. Export protocol. The source code of PZM Cash is open to everyone, which allows any developer to implement the PZM Cash protocol in their project as a kernel. To do this, users must deploy and run the full network node and install and synchronize a special API module. Currency at partners. PZM Cash can be used as a means of payment on partner projects and platforms. The web 3.js technology implemented in the PZM Cash wallet allows users to use their wallet to make payments on partner platforms such as exchangers, exchanges, IM, etc. Lastly guys, they end off the white paper explaining a cautionary note on forward-looking statements. This is very important to me as well guys because if they do not have this in the white paper, then I have to say that they're not being transparent. They do have this in the white paper in which they're not hiding anything from investors, potential investors, people who are interested, that kind of thing. All statements contained in this given white paper statements made in press releases or in any place accessible by the public and oral statements that may be made by PZM Cash or other respective directors, executive officers, or employees acting on behalf of PZM Cash that are not statements of historical facts constitute forward-looking statements. Okay guys, very important. Forward-looking statements. Some of these statements can be identified by forward-looking terms such as aim, target, anticipate, believe, could, estimate, expect, if, intend, may, plan, possible, probable, project. These forward-looking statements involve known and unknown risks uncertainties and other factors that may cause actual future results, performance or achievements of PZM Cash to be material different from any future results, performance or achievements expected, expressed or implied by such forward-looking statements. These factors include amongst others, changes in political, social, economic and stock cryptocurrency market conditions, the risk that PZM Cash may be unable to execute or implement their respective business strategies, changes in interest rates, changes in anticipated growth strategies, changes in the availability and fees payable to PZM Cash. Changes in the availability and salaries of employees who are required by PZM Cash to operate their business and operations. Changes in preferences of clients of PZM Cash. Changes in competitive conditions under which PZM Cash operates. Changes in the future capital needs of PZM Cash. War or acts of international domestic terrorism. Occurrences of catastrophic events. Other factors beyond the control of PZM Cash. Any risk and uncertainties associated with PZM Cash. Keep all of this in mind, guys, when you're looking at this project and considering your investment. Shout out to all my students, guys. I love you. Shout out to the Crypto Class Gang. Shout out to the Lambo Gang. Shout out to the Whale Gang. Shout out to the Hotto Gang. Thank you for always your continued support, guys. I really appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button for me and drop a comment in the comment section below. Please remember, guys, we are an impartial channel, so whether your opinion is negative or positive, we'd be more than happy to hear it. That being said, class is now dismissed. We'll see you in our next video. Professor Crypto out.